Hey guys, um, first off, want to apologize for the low video quality. Um, I'm recording this on an iPhone, so yeah, that's all I've got right now. So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how PSX Launcher can and will work on a PS2 that are lower than version 9. This particular PS2 model is a SCPH Dell. 70,012 model. In the drive we have Revolution X, a great classic arcade game, but uh, what we're going to go ahead and do is um, I'm using the sensor block mod, but uh, I have a flip top arriving in the mail, which uh, will add an additional port up here, which can just basically be removed from the top, a disc can be placed in without actually opening the tray. Um, make it difficult for the PS2 to read legitimate discs, so I'm going to go ahead and boot this up. gonna have to do that whole process over again uh, sorry about the bumpiness of the camera actually see if we can set this down no we really can't okay so I actually have to sit on my shirt and hope that it doesn't slide down and that's exactly what it's doing. I only have two hands so it doesn't make this easy. Ugh, come on. Hopefully y'all can still see the TV. Okay, so the way this has to work is the disc has to start the PSX and you have to map PSX launcher to one of the keys so that when you hold that key during boot up it will launch into that program. So I'm going to go ahead, I've taken Revolution X out of the disc drive, the tray. So Revolution X is out. And I'm going to go ahead and pop in Chrono Trigger. That falls well. This should work. Let's find out. looks good so far. Now sometimes this load screen will hang. That is not unusual. Okay. Again, looking good. But yeah, as long as you burn your discs fine, they play fine. The FMVs, full motion videos, will play just fine too. Okay, so far so good. Let's 
let's bump into lean. Oh, ouch. <laughs> well, watch where you're going next time. <laughs> All right. So there you have it. And just to show you what we got here. As you can see, the disc is still spinning. And that is a result of the sensors here and up in the upper left hand corner here being blocked. Again, it is much better to go with a flip top assembly up uh, the, this because if you do, um, it's less damage that way. Um, these being blocked makes it incredibly hard to swap out discs when you have um, games that are on 